Okay, ready. Okay, so we're going to have a look at Teodora's footwork today. She's been here the whole camp. Uh, hasn't really done the moves before, so the language is all new for her. But we're going to have a look at your uh, aggressive footwork first. So we'll have a look at the, the step downs, the low spins, the transfers, and the front foot hops. Then I'm going to speak to the camera and just give some feedback. Then we'll look at the rally footwork, which is the two foot pivot, the one foot pivot, the angles, hitting that sharp angle with the lateral hop and the closed backhand. And then we'll finish off with the defensive footwork, where we'll look at the moguls, the power moves, reverse spin, and the back foot hop. So let's give it our best, huh? Let's go. So I'll start off our ready steps. We're going to start off with that low spin forehand. So spin the hip, and cross back in front. Good girl. And spin the hip, cross back in front. Good. Run around transfer. So open up the stance and kick back. Good girl. And run around transfer again. Good. Do, do that again. Open the stance a little bit wider. Good girl. That was better. Okay. Ready step. Step down. Bring the legs through. Cross back. Good girl. And again. Step down. Bring the legs through. Cross back. Nice. Backhand step down. Good work. Keep crossing in front if you can. That was better. Okay. Front foot hop on the backhand. Recover back. Good again. And do that again. Front foot hop. Recover back. Nice. And then the forehand front foot hop. Come into the net. Good girl and split. Good, go back again. Do one more. Back, 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 back. Front foot hop. And you come. Hip. Beautiful hop and split. Lovely. Okay. Look, she's done a great job there. She really understands the moves. I love the lightness in her feet. How light she is. She's always split stepping really dynamically. And that's the key. Good to see her crossing over on those recoveries because when she first came she was side skipping back and that's one thing I definitely want to see is that she's crossing over with those recovery steps. With the low spin maybe just stay down a little bit lower as she comes, comes out but she's not over rotating which is really good. The transfer just let it drop a little bit sometimes she jumps a little bit too much on her transfer so it flies on her so maybe let it drop just a little bit so it's more in her strike zone, but she's kicking back. The thing that I said to the camera is she's really got to try and get her feet a little bit wider, a bit more semi-open. Sometimes she's a bit neutral, so her weight's not quite in the right spot. When she moves to a step down, it'd be nice if I could see her go step out, step down. Sometimes she's moving with the weight on the front leg like this. If she can go step out, step down, she can control where she wants to step a little bit better. So that'd be great. And her front foot hops fantastic. The only thing is sometimes a little bit straight. So make sure you keep the angles in her knee as she does the hop, but great energy. She's doing really well. Okay, let's do the rally. Start off with a two foot pivot first. So hit it nice and straight. Two foot pivot straight. Open the stance again. Two foot pivot. Good girl. And again, one foot pivot, lift the knee up. That's it, and again, one foot pivot, lift the knee up. Good, Ness, backhand, one foot pivot. Really good, backhand, one foot pivot. Nice, here we go with a lateral hop. So hit the angle, hop past it. Good girl, and again, lateral hop. Hit the angle, nice. And the backhand, closed backhand angle. Really good, and the closed backhand angle. Beautiful, do that one more time. Don't bring the leg around too quickly. That was better. Beautiful, good girl. So on that closed backhand, sometimes if you bring that leg around a bit too early, then you're going to dump it in the net, and you don't get that left hand really working up the back of the ball. Lateral hop, I'd like to see her working on finishing down here a little bit more and getting that knee up a little bit sharper. But she's a little bit straight-legged, and it pulls down the centre of the court. She can get those angles nicely on her backhand, but not so much on her forehand. So I like her to work on her forehand, forehand angles because she hits the ball so hard and flat. It'd be nice to have those angles and make that person not stand so far back, pull them in a little bit because she's got those angles and force them to actually have to cut the angle out to the ball. Uh, so that was really good. Two foot pivot, sometimes she's like this, sometimes she's like that. I don't mind either. Obviously more open when it comes quicker, a little bit more neutral if she's got time. And the one foot pivots, probably a little bit too much shape. I like to see it a bit more harbour bridge where it's 
a little bit faster and lower because sometimes it's a little bit too high and they've got time to run around it. So that one foot pivot is not something where they can run around and hit it. It's got to be penetrating the court um, a little bit better. But her attitude is unbelievable. She's so keen and that's why she plays so well on the court. So let's have a look at her defense. Oh, here we go. So ready, steps. We're going to start off with a back foot hop. Hop. Good, good, good again. Back foot hop. Good girl, that was a better swing. Back foot hop. And again, see so if you can get that knee up a bit straighter. Back foot hop. Excellent. Here we go. The reverse spin. Kick to me. And really good reverse. She loves the reverse. And again, reverse. Yeah, that's really good. I like the energy. Moguls on the back end. Two of them. Good. And again, stay lower on the mogul. Stay low on it. That was better. Forehand mogul. Here we go. Stay low. Really good. Forehand mogul again. Shift. Go pass the ball. Yes. Okay, backhand power move. Go, go, go. Kick. Good pick up. Go again. That was a tough one. Backhand power move. Forehand power move. Good. And again, backhand power move again. Go, kick. Good girl. And again, forehand power move. Go, 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 go. Bounce. One, two. Come back and split. Good girl. Woo! <laughs> so her power moves, I love that last one. Just see that little bounce step? It'd be nice one day that she can learn to slide after that. But that'll come, it's not that easy on this court. But her angles are beautiful on her power move. Um, one of those speeds were tough. So maybe in that one, she maybe just throw that up in the air if you can't get a good strike at that power move. Forehand mogul, she's a bit lower than her backhand mogul. So again, you've got to hit the mogul and get low, not hit the mogul and come up. So sometimes she comes up a little bit on that mogul. Uh, reverse spin was fantastic, good energy. Really was kicking nice and hard on that, so that looked really good. Back foot hop again, a little bit straight with the leg, and doesn't want to bring the knee up so much that she sort of gets cramped in her upper body. But she's been such a pleasure to teach. Her footwork and her movement, I believe, are nearly her best stroke. So if she can keep working on that footwork, that's going to be really good for her game because she's going to win a lot of matches just with her great footwork her great intensity, I call it, and her great competitive spirit. She's got a great attitude, so she's got to keep that up and she'll go really well in this game. So well done. Yeah.